Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. It's Friday the 17th of September. We've come back to the village of Muslimabad where yesterday we, we met this young nine year old who had a hole in his heart and who needed surgery fairly soon, each other. Um, otherwise, he would have a poor, poor outcome. So, we've come back to the village today um, to meet the young boy, inshallah, so I can introduce him to all of you personally so you can get an idea of what, what exactly it is we're talking about um, and hopefully raise the necessary funds. We need approximately four to five thousand pounds. Uh, to ensure that he gets the surgery which he needs, which is open heart surgery. Um, so we'll turn over to him now, inshallah, and I'll introduce him to you. So, Anakin, what's your name? Sinawi. Okay. How old are you? Suka Okay. Eight years old. Eight years old. Okay. And do you go to school? School to see? I'll give a cut to me. You go to school too. Okay. And how are you normally? How are you? How is your health? Stars to help you. Problem in his breathing. Problem in his breathing. Okay. And this is his uncle? Yeah. Okay, and could he tell us how he how he is in terms of what he can do? He's saying that when he like walks a few feet, then he feels breathless. And because he feels breathless, he cannot walk more, so he has to sit down and catch his breath. Okay. <laughs> how, how long has that been going on for? So, so much time we should have done that. Did I say? Did I say? It has been since birth. Since birth, okay. And when? When? Khelta hai? Khelta hai? Baki bachiyon ke saath? He can't walk and he can't play. He can't walk and he cannot play because you know he feels breathless. Okay. Fine, fine, fine. And when was this diagnosed? This hole in his heart? When when was it diagnosed? Four years ago. Four years ago. Okay. And what was done about it over the last four years? What was what was happened? They can't do anything. They can't do anything. Financially, they they can't do anything. Means they can't treat him, and even they can't uh, check him to uh, doctors and from doctors and from other sources. They have no sources. Okay. Fine. So just back to me. So so just just looking at, at the young boy, you can tell just by looking at him that he is out of breath. He's slightly breathless just sitting there talking uh, to us now. His lips are slightly blue, which is a sign of poor oxygenation um, to the rest of the body. So just from a medical perspective, he certainly looks unwell. Um, without treatment, and they've said that he's had no treatment for the last four years, um, this sort of condition in the UK will be routinely picked up at birth, will be treated, and the child will be as, as good as new in essence and will be sent home quite fit, quite healthy. Um, really, so over the last four years, this hole in his heart you know, has, has stayed the same size. The boy is growing. The body's needs in terms of on the heart will, will be growing as well. If we don't get the help to him fairly soonish, then he'll certainly suffer, at least in the short term, and his quality of life will be absolutely non-existent in the long term with the possible early, early death outcome. So it is something which we need to look at. We're going to be taking his details, his family details. We'll speak to the local doctors here to make sure we're in touch with them. When we come back to the UK, we'll be looking to raise funds for him as a matter of urgency to see if we can get some sort of operation arranged over the next four to five months, which will involve a full workup, um, the relevant outpatient appointments prior to the operation, the operation itself, and then post-operative care. So that's what we're going to be looking to do. So you've met the boy now, Mashallah. You know it's genuine. You've seen the family. You've seen everybody who's here. Everybody is gathered around. Everybody is concerned about his welfare. Um, they, they, brought, they brought him to us yesterday as soon as we came into the village. So it is something which we need to look at fairly urgently. So I'll, I'll leave it there, Inshallah, and, and we'll see what we can do when we get back to the UK. Jazakum Allah